What is up guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the i500 AirPods clone, aka the fake AirPods. Uh, so I think these are the Air AirPods 2 clone. Uh, this one has a wireless charging case as well. So this will work with Android and iOS. Uh, you do have the volume uh, adjustment touch feature on here. So you basically just swipe down uh, to be able to uh, change the volume, which is pretty cool. Come on. They're also promising 15 hours of battery life. You do have in-ear optical sensors. Like I said, that wireless charging case. And they said they improved the sound. Uh, they're saying it has noise cancellation. It's continuously adjusted at 200 times per second. Uh, I highly doubt that. But, you know, let's go ahead and check it out. Uh, as you can see, I have a very pessimistic out, uh, attitude towards these. Because uh, I just, I have, I have $10 pair of headphones that sound better than those $150 uh, AirPods. Let's try to get this open. Alright, so we have a little manual here. Tells you how to use it and all that stuff. Let's get this out. And uh, we have a generic iPhone charger here. Which is nice. So let's go ahead and get these guys out of the box, right out of the little pouch. Alright, so here it is. Here are the little AirPods. They're pretty small. They look kind of like the real ones. It's pretty close. We have the little charging case. It's got the little LED indicator on it as well. And I want to see if these wirelessly charge like they say they do. Alright, let's see if they'll actually wirelessly charge. So I got them in here and it should turn red. And there we go. So it does support wireless charging. Uh, that does work. So if you go to Bluetooth on your phone and we're only OnePlus 7 Pro, type uh, click AirPods and um, should go ahead and pair. Alright guys, so I got these things connected, I got them in my ear, I got Spotify loaded up, and they fit pretty well, I'm not going to lie, they're not falling out, I can jump up and down and shake my head and they're not coming out, uh, so they do actually fit pretty well. Uh, so let's go ahead and just test out a couple genres, so before I trash them, I'm going to give them a fair chance, so I'm just going to test out you know, different genres of music and see if they sound as good. Um, <laughs> my hold my tongue, guys. I mean, they. I mean, they're not the worst sounding headphones, but for fifty bucks, I don't know. So I mean. They sound okay. Let's try something with some more bass in it. Uh. So, I mean, they sound okay. It's not the worst sounding headphones, and if you have uh, Dolby Atmos on your phone put it on music mode it will help out because when it wasn't on uh when it wasn't set up it didn't sound that great but it does help the equalization with these but i mean they do have bass they're not um they're not lacking bass they do have bass so it's not like the the last pair i had uh with completely no bass let's try one more Let's try a jazz album. So I mean they sound pretty good. I'm gonna leave the room and see and try to walk to my front door and see if they are they still connect. So I was able to leave my room and go to the front door and it still was able to pick up the 
audio quality without glitching or anything like that. Uh, so let's go ahead and record some sound quality with the uh, voice recorder. Mic testing 212. Mic testing 212. Oh, let me unplug it. <laughs> let me unpair it. <laughs> it don't sound that bad. The audio quality. Mic testing two one two. Mic testing two one two. Yeah, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and let's see if they sync back automatically. Yeah, so that was pretty quick. Now that little swipe gesture thing on here for the volume, I can't get it to work at all. It just does not work very well. Uh, so that kind of sucks. But the if you double tap it, you're able to like pause. But even that's kind of glitchy. It'll pause and then it'll unpause sometimes. So it doesn't work that great as you can see. Like it's a little glitchy. If I double tap again. So that works but it is a little glitchy so overall I was pretty surprised they're not as bad um, yes those uh, Panasonic uh, headphones that cost ten dollars do sound better because they have the little uh, seal on the for the uh, tips uh, but you know these don't sound that bad they actually do have a little bit of bass to them uh, which I wasn't expecting um, they connect really fast uh, you have that charger on here the charger case so you can get up to 15 hours of battery life and the battery life on here, uh, you get it estimated around three to four hours. Uh, so, pretty decent for 50 bucks. Uh, not the best sounding, uh, but you can probably find you know something better for 50 bucks. But if you want to, you know, have the AirPods design, I guess they look pretty close to the original ones. I'll put a picture up to show you. They look pretty, uh, pretty close to the original AirPods. Uh, so that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching this video. And I will catch you guys in the next one.